Yo, what's up, everybody? It's Pierce Two Fat Boy, and we're gonna do a reaction video to Cobra Kai season six. Sorry, I'm a bit under the weather. I'm not feeling my best, but um, I really wanted to do this reaction video. Now, um, I grew up watching the Karate Kid. I um, huge fan of the series. You know, um, I still remember being a kid, ten years old, when I think the first movie came out, 1984. And watching that movie and doing the crane kick, I think every kid did that, trying to do the crane kick and, you know, falling over and breaking limbs or scuffing uh, a shin and uh, and we'd get up and do it again, you know, balancing on stuff, trying to do that crane kick. Um, but not only just the crane kick, like the movie itself, especially the first one, I feel, is, you know, it... Um, I know a lot of kids at school were getting picked on and beaten up, you know, and, you know, back in that day. And, uh, you know, uh, like, so the rejects, I was a reject, still am. And uh, watching that film and kids taking on, like, martial art lessons and learning discipline and stuff like that, um, not not to how to fight, but to defend yourself. Like, it, this was like the last resort situation. Like, if, if he was in an altercation or something. But anyway, what I've loved about the Cobra, so Cobra Kai TV series, when I first heard about it, I was like, what? Come on, don't do that. Like, can't you just let Sleeping Dogs lie? Like, let's just leave it at the movies. And I'm glad they didn't listen to me. And we're like, who would, who would know PS2? But um, what I have found about this show and what it's done, I think there's not many shows out there that can – generate the nostalgia but also bring a new audience into it right so you got the the young kids in the show who are learning martial arts from the older generation who we're watching so we're watching uh johnny and daniel um you know two two guys butting heads all the time and then you got the younger crew who are an appeal to the younger generation watching so i know so many uh, parents are sitting there watching this show with their kids saying, hey, I used to watch this. You should see the movies. And then also the key, the, uh, uh, keys to interest in the films as well. So the kids are watching these movies. So basically Karate Kid is basically Rocky for kids to me. That's what it is, Rocky for kids. You know, Daniel's son, the underdog. And, um, yeah, but I've loved what they've done with this show. And they've brought, like, every man – and every character from every movie have come through, and um, and with season five ending up on a nail biter, I like I like that was a great season. Like so much shit was going down, we didn't know. Like you couldn't get a breather. Like honestly, you couldn't break a breather. But anyway, Cobra Kai season six is debuting on Netflix on January uh, July sorry July eighteenth. Now this is going to be in parts, which I mm, I hate that crap. Like, I really do. That's one thing that does annoy me. Like, just just play the whole thing. Let people get it out of their system. Because, like, they'll end up on a nail biter. Because I believe this is going to be in three parts. So we're going to get part one of season six and then the other two parts in 2024, I believe. So then we're going to wait another six bloody months. So they're milking it. All right. Okay, that's my little pet peeve of the show. Like, don't. They should just. That's the whole idea of getting Netflix and Pay description so we can watch it all in one hit. I hate it when they do this crap. But I got that out of my system. Let's watch the trailer, see what Cobra Kai Season 6 Part 1, sounds dumb, is going to be. And is it going to be worth the watch? Is it going to be worth the hype? And, uh, yeah. Anyway, I've got the trailer here. I probably have to turn the music down because no doubt we'll have some 80s banging theme in the background and I don't want to get copyright restrictions from YouTube. I'm watching you, YouTube. So anyway, without further ado, let's check out Season 6, Part 1 of Cobra Kai. We've been through a lot to get to this point. Miss Terry. Finally on the same page. We may have settled things in the valley. But now we have to be ready. That kiss? The world throws at us. It is kiss. Oh, they got a big tournament. Okay. You're gonna fight the best in the world. Do I want to know what that's for? Training. Rocky Four style. Rocky Four style. Carry to its snow. What could possibly go wrong? What? 
Oh, Chris, let's go. It's one thing to be the best in town, it's another to be the best in the world. I can't believe in real life she's 28 years old. She looks like she's 18. It's scary. I thought you were Miyagi-Do now. You think things are better because now I'm training in your dad's backyard. I think we have our strongest team. Oh, look at that mohawk. Love it. Part one, July 18 on Netflix. Netflix throwing the nostalgia at us again. Okay. Um, that looks awesome. Like that looks great. But like I said, my only pet peeve is part one BS. Like just have the whole bloody thing there. I like, it, you know what, you know what I mean? Like you wait six months or something and then you probably have to do a refresh and watch a couple episodes from the previous episode. So you know where you're at. I hate that crap. I really do. But that the trailer looks banging. I love the Kiss song that was went with it. Um, it looks great and I'm looking forward to seeing Cobra Kai. Um if you also if you guys want a review of the Cobra Kai T V series of part six, season six, part one, geez, that's a mouthful. Uh when it comes out, I will probably watch it within a few days, depending how busy I'm at work. Um, but I would love to do a review about it. And if you want to hear a review from PSU Fair Boy, let me know in the comments down below. And also Thanks for watching. If you're new to the channel, please subscribe, like. If you don't like the video, please, you know, tell me in your thoughts. But um, I really do appreciate you guys coming in here watching the videos. Um, as you may know, I do a lot of gaming content, and I'm just feeling really burnt out doing gaming stuff. I mean, I love streaming games, and I love playing games, but I love movies, man. I love TV shows, and I love the stuff that I grew up with and that I got my kids to watch. And, like, my kids love Cobra Kai. Like, when I was 10 years old watching Daniel uh, Russo doing the crane kick, you know, Ralph Macchio, um, you just, back, you know, your imagination just went nuts. Like, you thought you could do the same thing, and, you know, and you probably could, and, and you end up breaking a leg or scraping a shin, but it's worth a shot. But anyway, I'm glad that they're keeping the um, the show alive and well, and unfortunately, this is the last season. But um, we'll just go and watch the reruns again. We'll just rewatch it. And, um, and like I said... It's such a great show to get the older generation, Gen Xers, who watch this show as the kids themselves and now watching the show themselves. I don't think there's any other show that does it like this. Like this show, getting an older generation and a younger generation to watch something together. Like I've watched this with my, with my kids and they absolutely loved it. So um, honestly, uh, Cobra Kai Season 6 Part 1, July 8th. Bring it.